Okay, everybody, take your player board. Uh, Tari? Yes. Uh, oh, hello. Do you want to? No, no, no. no, no. I'm leaving soon. I'm leaving soon, man. What? Somebody. Somebody's picking me up. Yeah. It doesn't make a difference for me. He's, he's, he's not my brother. Take that what now? Say what now? Have you, Say have what you now? more than 100 kilos? I did not bench press at all. Good to know. I have no idea. I never met first. Mom, and the uh, glucophage? No. Mm -hmm. I have glucophage. Unfortunately. Glucophage. Who made that? Well, look. Mafrut. Answer in the other. And the other. Answer. It's That's why I like this. Ah, That's why I like this. No, something here was like man. Yeah. All right. Take this. And put it mm -hmm. mm -hmm. there. And for the shots yet. Put them on the top of the head. Let them put the dirty body. Da. Wait. What? So this is this guy's here. All right. So. Wait. What? This girl is here. But that's the story that I saw, huh? Hey. What if you get that ish to try? If he's there and design, middle hard, but more mobile. What? Middle. Has a mixer in the fridge or whatever. Okay, over here. No, no, no. Okay. You are here. No, no. Hello. You are here. No. Uh, over here. 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 Yeah, yeah. kind of fun. Yes. Wow. That was much deduction. I know. Okay. So, so you ready? Yeah. So I'm going to start reading. Component and setup. One. <laughs> game board. Play Come on, man. What the heck? <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, just seeing just see what's the starting cash. Everybody starts out with uh, placing indicators. Uh, Set up. Oh, uh, if you invade me, honey. Not not, the, not not anymore. I learned from the last time. Hey. <laughs> Wait, what was the last time? <laughs> well, which game was it? Four access between two hands. First player. First game. Ah, he's more. I just tell you, can I <laughs> so first of all, let's, let's, uh, let's determine who is the first player. Come on, come on. Obviously, it's me. Schnazzy. I was using it before it became popular. Farudi? No, English is Madra. And you could say, I am the pioneer. <laughs> I told you, obviously, it's me. <laughs> It's always him. Okay. It's always him. So, I'm always in on it. So since you are the starting player, I'm gonna put the recommended setup for for first player for our first game. So you start with one noble, two priests, and one merchant. So the noble, which what what huh what what exactly. wait, what I don't know the... which is which. I don't know which is which. So the noble is the dude with the braids, wearing the braids on his necklace. This guy. Yeah. So you get one noble. Honey, you get one noble. Me and you get no nobles, okay? Uh, two priests, and the priests look like the uh, the guy with the bunny bunny rabbit, with bunny ears. <laughs> the guy with the staff. Yeah, the guy with the staff. Oh, okay. Well, there are two staffs. Right? <laughs> two priests. Okay. So you got to move them across two priests. I know. Uh, honey, no priests. No priests, no priests, okay? And one merchant, and the merchant 
Yeah, I'm much it looks into, like yeah. the one with the spinner. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> one merchant. One. One. One Four. merchant. One. One what? merchant. So one. what is this? This is this six? Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> Army, no merchants. Okay, what? you already have one noble, three soldiers. The soldier is the one with the spear. The man is behind the sword. I need the sword. What? 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 What is this? Just, just go with the flow. To the left and to the right. To the left. To the right. Wait, so I get how much? The three soldiers. Three soldiers. So, one noble, two priests, one merchant. You're supposed to have four population. One noble, two priests, oh, yeah. one merchant, and three soldiers. No, you don't get the soldiers. I don't get the soldiers? You don't get the soldiers. I get the soldiers. Hey, I'm good. You got the merchant. You got the three soldiers. You got the three soldiers. Yeah. Um, one priest, you get one I mean, artisan. An artisan. Shaklu in the middle. That one. One? Artisan yes. or artisan? And I also get an artisan. Artisan? artisan? Artisan. Yeah. Artisan. And three merchants. And merchants, no weapon spinner. <laughs> and I get three scholars. The scholar is one carrying the scroll. One, two, three. Okay. Can you repeat what I get? So Sorry. you get one noble and three soldiers. And that's it. Okay. And uh, you get one noble, two priests, one merchant. Okay. Everybody's supposed to have four. One, uh, one artisan, ah. three merchants. There you go. And I get one artisan and three scholars. Okay, <coughs> great. Now what? Right? Now, now the again? starting... Let's pretend that didn't happen. <laughs> you get treasure chamber and monument. Treasure chamber. Hey, don't, don't read here. it. Don't read it. And don't, don't monument. Read it. Don't read it. It's not like here we go. Reads. Honey, you get the tenement and training grounds. Yeah, and is this uh, public knowledge or love? Yeah. yeah. Fine. Tenement. Fine. Tenement. Tenement. Training you grounds. You peasants. Marketplace and shipyard. Marketplace and shipyard. Not a shipyard. Not the marketplace. And I get the scriptorium and road. Alright, uh, and how have you kid up? Or how have you kid up? Yeah, let's start catching up. Yeah, so you're the first player, you get that? No, no, I get this. How do you know? <laughs> how do you know? Is that a bell? Ding, 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 ding. Yeah, kid, it looks like. Seriously. Ding, 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 ding. Ding, 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 ding. But I have the air, my carrier. Okay. So ding, 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 ding. Carrier. Alright. So, and how many gold do we start off with? Uh, okay. You are not ready to play. Something on you, man. You are not ready to play. <laughs> Poof! I caught the piece, and the human was distracted. <laughs> okay, everybody <laughs> gets 20, 20 <laughs> coins. See, told you. Told you. Where did you read that? I said 20. <laughs> <laughs> he felt it. <laughs> okay. Kida Mafud Khalasna al setup. Okay. Okay. So the game. Mm -hmm. What the about game, the game? It is going to be in three eras and each era is two rounds. Mitated the nukes. A nukes? Sarah. Okay. So in the first era, the basis of the game, you have tiles that you're going to take from the board and put it on the top row. Okay. Okay? On each tile it's going to tell you that you're going to spend amount of time. You also put this on the top row. For instance, I chose to take this one. If I take this, I have to put it on the left and look at the uh, hourglass mm -hmm. on the top right and I put that many hourglass on the right, right side. Okay? okay. Uh -huh. So these are the remaining actions I have remaining. Okay. Oh, okay. So we're gonna keep taking turns, actions until this is full. Then you pass. Okay. 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 Interesting. Okay. Okay. Once you place it over here, you do the action, whatever it says. The top left corner over here is usually 
the amount of coins that you have to pay in order to take it. Okay. Top right is the amount of time that you have to put on the time track in order to take this. Okay. And the symbol in the center is the action that you're going to take. طب ايش ال ايش ال symbol هذه this is telling me if it's a four player or three player games. It's, ah. it's just for the setup. الصورة اللي هنا في النص it's basically you get to play the card. صورة الكارت وفي زي زي الصوت كده بيطلع من الجوال. لا it's a poof. A card appears. It's a card. It's not. It's a slap. It's a slap on the okay. the card on, is on the table. ما أنا قاعد أقول لك طلعت الصورة اللي تحت النفلين يقول poof. A card disappears and a human got distracted. في اليمين في اليمين. Okay. Yeah. Well, there you go. Yeah. Okay. So in order, الحين كلنا عندنا كارتين في يدنا. In yes. order to play the card, you have to take one of these tiles over here, and then you get to play it. Or any action that shows this icon, and you place it in your action place, you get to play the card in, in front of your tableau. Okay. Okay? Mm -hmm. Tableau is the one that the tableau. Oh, okay. So, the tableau will have a tableau in front of them. Okay. And it in front of them. Okay. And it would give you certain benefits. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, Hadi binisbil this card. So this one lets you play cards from your hand into your tableau. How do you gain cards? It's over here. The plus symbol and a card. You get to take one of these cards over here. <clears throat> okay. So the, all these are available. You can pay six and one time and you get to take one card. Six one time you get one card. Eight two times and one card. Uh, eight and one time, one card. Ten, two times, and one card. And you, you might be asking yourself, Dave, why would I want to take something more expensive when there is something less expensive? <laughs> so, uh, this one allows you to take cards over here. The, basically, the ones on the left is the cheapest, the ones on the right is the most expensive. Uh, so, if I take a six, I'm going to take this, I have to pay six coins, I take one time, just like that, and I get to take one or two cards up to a value of six, because I paid six over here. So, six, six. if I want to take two cards, six and two cards, I can take any two cards from here. Okay. Okay? Uh, if I paid eight, I can take uh, just two cards from here. Any, any two cards from here, oh, this range. Okay. If I pay 10, I can take three cards anyway, anywhere from here. So that's why you might want to take a 10 over here. Okay? So in order to take cards from here to your hand, you take this action in this okay. area. Okay. Okay? So right now we have play cards from your hand, this area, and play cards from your hand in this area. Draw cards. Uh, uh, draw cards. Okay. Now, you're spending money. How do you gain money? Mm -hmm. The basic way of gaining money is this area over here, and it does not have any tiles. You just put time and the number of coins that, that is indicated over here. So I can take one time and get four coins, or I can take two times and get eight coins. So I just put the time markers over here on the rightmost area. I either can put two times, sharing one space, oh. or I can separate them, okay? Uh, okay. And there's a certain benefit why you want to uh, combine them or separate them. Uh, or you take one time and you get four coins from the bank, okay? Uh, so this is without taking a tile because <coughs> this area is empty. It does not have any tile. Okay. Uh, now. In order to play cards from your hand, you have to meet certain requirements. In the Ibda Ish, the workers in Mawjudin here. The Tala from Kurut, and the one, three, well, one and two, the Tala from the tableau, from the from the player board tabak, you have to have that many number of workers in order to play the uh, uh, the cards in front of you. Okay. 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 Meaning, for example, you have one and three. And the key to one and three. That's why this is a recommended uh, setup oh. yeah, for the okay. first player. What uh, yeah, yeah. you know, you meet the requirements. Yeah, 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 you meet the requirements.
All right? Uh, so that's the reason why you want to meet the requirements. Then you want to play the cards in your hand this way. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's say that you have cards that you want to gain, uh, that you need to meet more requirements in order to get... Uh, just more. You need to get more workers in order to meet the requirements of the cards that are available. Mm -hmm. So it's uh, meeting the requirements. Okay. Uh, in order to gain workers of a specific type, you go in this area. There are, there are four actions available. You take the ones that you want. Top left is the amount of coins you pay. Top right is the time that you put. And you take the tile into your player board. Once you take it, I spent eight coins, so I can either get up to eight for one person uh, all the way across, or I can get two persons. Well, since I already paid eight, I'd want to get any two persons all the way from, uh, from across. And this is the most expensive one. I choose the one that I want. Let's say I wanted this guy, and then I move him across, and I wanted this guy. So I advance him one, and the other guy won, but then there's a certain way that it has to re reset yeah. itself. Okay. It's usually the one to the most right is the one that enters first, the most left enters uh, last. <coughs> and they all scooch down. Okay. And the requirements, you can either gain one worker and the cost is on the top, or two workers where the cost is on the bottom. Okay? Mm -hmm. So far so good? Mm -hmm. So, yes. uh, just to repeat, we're going to play cards over here, Gain cards over here. Uh, try to meet requirements for cards by getting workers over here. And get money over there. And get money over there. And the the Top left is going to be here. Hadi, I think it's the last thing that we should uh, talk about. What, what are the actions that you get from the cards? Yeah, it's going to be sort of difficult to understand until we get the concept first. Okay, okay. Uh, final area. Uh, of getting tiles is this area over here. Uh, this one's meeting requirements and you get bonus points uh, once you meet the requirements. It's not an action space. Uh, over here you get to place buildings that everybody has in their small storage area. Okay. Other than houses. So, uh, in order to build a house, I pay, uh, this one's an example, pay zero and get three times. And I can build a house in any one of these places where it has that icon. Goods, I would say that. So, the goods locations are located over here, over here, 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 and here and here. And that place over there. So I can place my house in any one of these locations. As soon as I place the house in that location, I get the benefit that's showing on the bottom. Okay. In this case, I get plus five coins. Okay? Jador Tani, and I got to put another house. Jit hatat al house in this area. I, I took this eye, I paid zero coins three times, I put it here, and I put it in this area. I get a cube and I activate all the, uh, all the green areas that have my house on it. So I get a cube um, and I get five coins. <laughs> Next time I got another house, Marabu, in the green area. I get all three, uh, all three benefits. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. I might be mistaken on this, but uh, I'll I'll double check because it might be like that, or it might be it would only activate when I place it in this area over here. Okay. Uh, but I'll double check and we'll get back to that. So uh, the other option is to place a house over here. You would ask yourself, like, what is the benefit to build a house in this area? The benefit uh, is that it would allow you to activate uh, the houses that you have in any one of the three colored areas. You can choose the yellow, red, or green. And once you choose that area, you activate all your houses in that area. And it also unlocks the abilities of these that you get to choose uh, uh, on return. Once you activate it on the cubes, you can place the cube right next to your house, indicating you have activated it and you take that virtual action. Are some more virtual actions? It's as if you play the card, the tile in your player board, you pay the, the coins, you pay the time, but there is no tile that you put here, so you save that spot, 
and you do the action. Okay. So these ones are just like the purple ones. You gain a card from the tableau. You gain over here uh, workers. And over here is again worker and you get to multiply the coins that you get over here. Ooh. Okay? Uh, you'd be asking yourself, why does this have uh, an intermittent uh, border? These are uh, uh, some uh, variables, multipliers, modifiers. They call these modifiers. So it's not an action in itself. You want to do two of those. This is a modifier, and you want to do another action with that modifier. Okay. And what does it allow you to do? Rather than paying the specified amount for getting the card. If I have this modifier uh, activated, I can choose the amount that I want to pay rather than paying the amount that is showing on the on the top. What's the catch? And we can then have modifier. It's a modifier. It's not an action. Yeah, I mean, take it through Hinak, but you can only do it once. So the cube Hina, and this modifier is activated only for that uh, turn. And you would take one of these. Okay. So this is six, but I can pay ten okay. based on that uh, instead of uh, paying the exact six. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. I think uh, and this one basically you get two coins and you get the first player marker for the next turn. Okay. I think I'm we have what <laughs> first player first player marker. First player. Okay. okay. All right, I think right now we can go through the, uh, the icons uh, on what they do. Can I let let's see. So, in this one, you passively have one of these workers a plus one. If you have this card in your tableau, you passively have this dude, which is the... Uh, the priest, you Plus passively one. have one priest in your tableau. This one you get five coins every night phase, uh, and the night phase is basically the cleanup phase after we finish our turns. We do a cleanup, so the moon means it's a night phase. There's a heyday yeah. phase, which is where we all take our actions. Once our actions are finished, the night phase is when we do the actions that are showing in, uh, in with the moon. <laughs> Squish. Squish. <laughs> it's a night phase for him. This means you can pay three coins uh, to gain one point. Okay. And you can do that up to five times during the night phase. This means you can remove a lock over here and get more actions. Ooh. Okay. This one allows you to get uh, a work over here, but you have to place a cube showing that this can only be done once per round. Okay. Okay. And in the night fades, it, all these cubes are removed. Uh, this one's it's the same thing, three coins, uh, get one point up to five times. Every night phase, you get two coins per every worker of this type. And this one, you, uh, you get plus one of that worker and plus one of that worker. Uh, but look at your cards, do you have questions on the um, to the infinity symbol. So the infinity symbol, you don't have to activate it. Once it's in your tableau, right away it's it's activated uh, for you throughout the whole game. It's a passive ability. So for you, any time you take uh, a tax, you get it multiplied. So instead of four, you get uh, eight. Um, can he use the modifier? He can use that, but it's going to be times three. It's not going to be two times two times six. <laughs> That's not how math works. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's plus one to multiply. Okay. Uh, let's see. At the, uh, at the night phase, you get two coins for every that type of that worker. And uh, this one, you get a card. Uh, once you activate it, the cube Aleha. You can yeah. obtain a card in the tableau up to a value of four. Well, no, this, I get a worker, so. And this one, you get a worker, you pay two, yeah. and you place a cube on that. Uh, two? Pay two? Oh, yeah. yeah. So, if you have the Kadal modifier, which is a worker plus one, you get one additional worker within the same range of what you pay for. So, into method up to two for one. So, you can get another worker from here okay. if you pay two, if you have that 
modifier <laughs> activated. I have a question on workers. For example, I paid six. Mm -hmm. Can I get two of the same worker? Or yes, no? you okay. can. Uh, finally, uh, four icons on these on these uh, on the cards. So once you play a card into your tableau, you choose which one of the icons you get to activate, and you get that many number of points. Oh, you choose one of these icons. You only have one and one in your tableau. Second time you play, you're going to play it like this. So I get to choose any one of these icons, and I get that many number of points. Mm. They're both the same same type of okay. icon. So if I choose a star, I get one, two points, and I uh, advance in the uh, victory point. Aight, aight, aight. Aight, everybody aight. put their uh, house type. Plug in the house in my houses. Oh, no. Nice. I think that's when you add it, yeah, this is plus 50. Yeah. Hehehehe. That brings memory, dude. Hehehehe. Wow. You're going to play with me, right? Yes. 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 So, after I put my cube in here, and turn it as done. Yeah. Okay. So in the right phase, you remove all cubes. Am I Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. See if it casts out. You can. No, it's not meant to be casted. Where did it cast out? I think in the dollar, in the zawiya. Yeah, that's it. Yes. So. While I clean the houses, yeah. Okay. So. Every time you put your house. Ah, mom. Ah. I said I bought the Warcraft Classic. I got a field forty man. Field forty man raid. Forty man raid. Yeah. And the loot. I don't know. Is it worth it? The man, no, I don't know. It's randomized loot. The man should have won. What? The man should have won. You're recording the break time. Yeah, actually, in just a minute, so it doesn't make a difference. Hey, hey, me and I took a minute to do it with Hagduk. Yeah, they cannot. Oh, it doesn't matter if you do it. Yeah, I'm more Hagduk. Hagduk. Hagduk? So if you had a hint in something, I don't know. Okay. So, a few reference sheet, it's a kind of few cards. Okay. You didn't know what it is. It would tell you what uh, what it like, is. Uh, should I start playing? Uh, build one city and city. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's uh, so. good. So is it some you, you might want to designate an area for your tableau and an area where it's your hand. Okay. I don't trust you. So, uh, as part of the strategy, you might want to look at the icons you yeah, have and that's the workers that, that are required. That's what I'm doing. الحين الواك يروح forever ولا يروح lock yes once it's removed it's gone forever okay so ايه 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 شان so let me just describe to you this one we have first one to have eight cards in their tableau gets to Passively receive this, and this gives you eight points, and all progressive ones are four points. 
First one with 18 total workers without virtual workers.